اعوذبلرجیم بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم رب شرح علی صدری و یسلی عمری وحل العقتم السانی یفقہ قولی ایز وی ہیو اسٹارٹیڈ یونٹ ٹو دیٹ واز اباؤٹ میکنگ آف پاکستان سو سو فار وی ہیو اسٹڈیڈ اباؤٹ دا امپارٹنٹ ایونٹس دیٹ ہیپن اینڈ ہیلپ ان دا فارمیشن آف پاکستان وی ہیو اسٹڈیڈ اباؤٹ دا ایونٹس دیٹ ہیپن بفور نائنٹین فورٹی then the most important event in the history of Pakistan was Lahore Resolution that happened in 1940. After 1940, the other major events that happened were the res- resignation of Congress ministries in 1939. As we know that when the Congress ministries resigned, India was left with nothing and they don't uh, india don't have any legislative or executive council so there was a constant a need of interim government that should support the next coming elections and should give the ideas for the future constitution of india so for that there was a need to bring muslim league and congress together and the effort that was done to bring Muslim League and Congress together was done by Raj Gopal Acharya. He was a liberal Congress leader and how he has brought Muslim League and Congress closer, he has given some suggestion and those suggestions were known as CR formula. It was given in 1944 when there was an utmost need of interim government. In order to bring closer Muslim League and Congress, he has suggested that they will, if Muslim League will cooperate with Congress in the making of interim government, the Indian liberation can be confirmed. That means that if India will be liberated, that means if India will get independence from the British, Muslim League has to cooperate with Congress for the making of interim government. Now that interim government, why there was a need of interim government? There was a need of inter- interim government to decide the future constitution and the future elections that were to be held in the future. So. He has further decided to gain the sympathies of Muslim League. He has suggested that all the Muslim majority areas in Northwest and in Northeast should be determined by the Commission and they should be given the choice of a referendum after the war will be ended. And due to their choice of referendum, they can decide that either they want to be with India or they want separation. And if they want a separation, how various matters will be divided. That includes defense, commerce, communication and many of the other matters as well. Now, what were the impacts of CR formula. If we generally see, it was totally the first and the most important point was the separation of Northwest and Northeast of subcontinent. And that was totally against the agenda of Congress. Now, is the Congress never wanted India to get divided. So the Congress committee has rejected the proposals. While Muslim League was astonished that why a Congress leader will accept the separation of all the Muslim dominated areas. Therefore, the Qaeda-e-Azim Muhammad Ali Jinnah has criticized that if Raj Gopal Acharya is accepting the separation, is acceptance, uh, accepting the liberation 
of muslim dominated areas why he is reluctant to not accept lahore resolution that means there was something wrong at bottom therefore muslim league has clearly criticized the cr formula but it has left the great importance in the history of india because the separation of india was highlighted for the very first time and the most important is that it was highlighted by the congress leader that was kind of a victory for muslims of india but the question arises that whether this separation that was highlighted will be supported further after the making of interim government or will left behind as the congress ministries has already done by oppressing the muslims of india so after the rejection of cr formula there was an effort done by gandhi ji to bring jina on the table for dialogues so various meetings were held at jina's residency and there was the exchange of 28 letters among the two leaders of muslim league and indian national congress the Cong the uh, gandhi was of the view that whether the people are of different religion their nationality can't be changed they will be still indians that means if the hindu hindus are following hinduism and muslims are following islam it does not have anything linked with their nationality hindus and muslims both are living in subcontinent that means india and therefore their nationality will be indian while khaidiazm was of the view that there is the difference of nationality between hindus and muslims how the nations can be differ it is on the basis of their views the civilization culture mode of living ancient history and most importantly the most important difference of hindus and muslims was the religion and that make the difference in the nationality of muslims and hindus therefore no proper result was withdrawn from gandhi jina talks and thus they failed but kaidyazm has somehow uh convinced gandhi that india should be divided on the basis of difference of nationality after that this there was still a problem of interim government so interim for the formation of interim government the viceroy at that time has announced that there was a need of formation of executive council of viceroy so he decided to call upon all the representatives of the parties to decide the interim government that will include the foreign affair ministries and the finance ministries and defense ministries at that time the japanese were expanding in world war 1 they were conquering the world so there was a threat to india that they may enter into india as well so lord wevel has decided to get the sympathies of both of the parties so he decided that equal representation will be given to muslims and hindus in the executive council of viceroy but the question rises that who will be the muslim representative is the congress who was claiming themselves as the sole representative representative of all indian nations so they decided to send their muslim representative while 
Hazar Hayat Khan, who was heading the party in Punjab, wanted to be the representative of Muslims, while Qaid Azam was of the view that Muslim League should send the Muslim representatives. So he asked Lord Babel to describe the representatives, list of representatives on which Lord Bevel was unable to withdraw any conclusion. Thus, he has announced the failure of the conference, similar conference. And as a result, he himself has decided to held the elections in 1945 and 1946 for the formation of future executive councils and legislative councils.